The Association of American Medical Colleges projects there could be a shortage of up to 122,000 physicians by the year 2032 in both primary and specialty care. That is scary stuff. Let's find out why and what is being done to help out with it. Kate Rogers joining us live in Arizona with more on this important story. Kate. Hi, Brian. That's right. You just said it. The AAMC says there could be a shortage of up to 122,000 doctors in the United States over the next decade. Part of that's due to the aging population. People are living longer and seemingly more healthy lives and need more care later into life. We're here in Arizona. The state is currently short about 600 physicians. That number could triple in the next decade. The state is 44th in the nation for its ratio of primary care physicians to population. And the population here is growing very quickly. The shortage is felt even more in rural areas where there can be just one physician for thousands thousands of residents. Now, one way to fix the issue is by adding more residency opportunities. We're here at Abrazo Health. The hospital system recently launched two new residency programs for internal mes medicine and general surgery. By not having enough spots, there are many physicians who have gone through medical school and don't get a chance to train. And thus, we think that we are fulfilling a need for further physicians to be trained and to actively serve our patients. The hope is that the more residents that come to Arizona to complete their training will wind up staying here once that residency is complete. There are studies out there that say just about half of residents uh, that complete their training in one location will wind up staying there, Ryan, to do that important work afterwards. Back over to you. Well, well, well Kate, from what I understand is that there's, you know, listen, you have to have a license, obviously. But, but Arizona has changed some of its licensing requirements to make it easier for people from out of state and I guess maybe even out of the country to come in and help out. That's right, Brian. So we, we chatted with Governor Ducey here yesterday in Arizona. They have a universal uh, licensing recognition law that just kicked in recently. They, Arizona is the first state in the nation to do this. So if you come here from another state and you have a license in, in pretty much any occupation, you can gain similar licensing here in a much easier fashion. So hopefully that's attractive to physicians that are considering moving to Arizona and not necessarily wanting to repeat all of that training. So hopefully they can fill you know, some of the gap and fill that shortage here. Now, listen, that is a very, very important story. Kate Rogers, 247 out there, and we, we appreciate it. Thanks for bringing that story to us, Kate. <laughs>